Hello everyone, this is 2017 uh, Toronto Auto Show and I'm a Hyundai Boost and Hyundai has a 3 Ionic series. This is a plug-in hybrid. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's very really nice. And that's the uh, just the hybrid. No matter like a regular hybrid like a Prius and it's a full electric. And let's take a look at the just the plug-in hybrid first. This is the inside. And it's I can't really see anything like because the power is not on. But you can see it has heated steerings and like heated seats and uh, I guess this is a uh, HEV. I have no clue probably hybrid or maybe electric mode. And free collision system probably they do have because I see some uh, cruise control. Uh, Adaptive cruise control buttons here, and also has a lane keeping assistance service uh, system, and and that's the uh, blind spot for sure. That's the home link. Unfortunately, they don't have a, a panoramic moonroof, but they do have a fair amount of size of sunroof, and it's kind of similar to Prius. Let's go over. Let's go over the uh, just a regular hybrid car. So this is a regular hybrid. Oh wait a second, I'm gonna check the range for this. So it has a 1.6 liter <coughs> inline four cylinder uh, direct inject engine and with a 45 kilowatt electric motor and 8.9 kilowatt hour lithium iron uh, battery. And uh, let's see, it doesn't really say that. Oh, it goes to 40 kilometers up to electrics. It's not bad, but still, Chevy Bort is much better. Close to 100k. And this is a full, this is just a hybrid. Let's take a look at it. Uh, has a subwoofer in the back, and hmm, I don't see the tire here. It's very deep, you know? Really, it's very nice. It looks like a chromish, but it's not really chrome. It's okay. It's chromish. And obviously, they try to go with the LED lights. Lots of LEDs and radars for the free collisions. It's almost identical to any other uh, Ionic, so let's skip this interior. Let's take a look at back seats. That's lit. Oh, it's hidden seats in the back seat. I'm 5'10. The headroom is alright but I, in the back seat, but I think it's not gonna be good if you are over 6 feet for sure. It's kind of like. And this is the full electric. Aha, uh -huh, look at this. Look at this. It has the gear, gear switch, gear knob. And uh, obviously, no grease in the front. And let's see. It has a, of course, up to 200 kilometer range emission free driving. Isn't as good as a, a Tesla Model 3 or other electric vehicle, but. It's really. Man, see, come sit in the seat, move it. I'm staying in the back seat. I'm moving. It's a happy. This armrest. The trunk space <sighs> totally is less capacity than the regular hybrid because of the size of battery, I assume. 